guys we're back for another tutorial in the 12 days of christmas challenge today i'm going to show you how i made um, this design little let it snow image with our uh, little girl here on the card um, basically it came together really quickly in canva and i'll show you so first you're going to want to open up canva you'll go to create design we're going to choose card. Once that comes up, we will pick a color for the background. Let's see the color I use is this dark grayish color. I'm going to click on the default palette. <clears throat> And see, the background color was 232323. Three, two, three. So I'm going to enter that in here. There we go. And next, I put in these little dots that kind of look like snow. And if you type in dots confetti, you'll get a few different choices. And this one is the one that I used. Um, I'm going to change the colors because they're a little too bright. So we'll click on the plus again. Uh, the first color I used was FCD 6C6. Enter that in and just click that goes in there. The second color was the same. Well, what I can do is copy and paste it. That'll be easy. There it is. I can highlight it. Control C to copy it. Go to the second one. Go back to the plus. Highlight it. And then Control V to paste it. And now to choose the third color, go back. Click on the plus, and this one was E one C zero seven six. Away, yeah. So I'll move this one down to the bottom, and I will enlarge it by clicking on it and then pulling out one of the corners, which says resize. Go down to about uh, maybe about three quarters, a quarter of the way down. I'm going to copy it and then bring up the copy up to the top. Now I'm going to copy again, uh, except this time I'm going to make this copy a little transparent, about mm, 46, maybe 50, 57 was okay. And then I'm going to tilt it by clicking on this little blue circle arrow and then just tilting it in one direction to the left. Move it over. And I'm going to copy it again. Tilt it to the right. Move it up. Okay, click away. And now I'm going to put in my text. So I'll come over to the T for text. Click on Add Heading. And click inside the, where it says Add Heading. I'm going to, let's change the font first. I'm going to use one of my favorites. That's not it. It's clicking too fast. A uh, playlist script is what I used. And here it is. Click on that. I had it size to 80. Then I'll click inside there and type in my text, which was let it. No. 
I'm just going to pull out, see where it says stretch when you put the mouse cursor over the box. Just pull that out. So it's all on one line now. And I'll move that down about right there. And the last thing uh, I'm going to do is to upload my image, my clip art. There she is. I'm going to resize her. It's too big for what I want. Like that. Make it a little smaller again. And then I'm going to go to where it says Arrange. Click on Arrange. And I'm going to click Back. One time, two times, uh, two times is okay. So I'll bring it forward one time. So I can just get some of the little dots. So it looks like it's kind of like it's snowing on her. And uh, let me make... Bring this up just a little bit. Okay. And that's it. That is how I made the image for this week. That um, if you're watching this today on Friday, it's Freebie Friday and you can download it for free in the group. So miss, don't miss out on that because the download is only going to be available until Sunday. So go ahead and grab that and um, let me know how you're using it. I would love to see. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask me any questions that you might have, um, uh, any requests, let me know. And go ahead and share this uh, with a friend by um, letting a friend know um, to invite them to the group if you think they're interested in planner, stickers, or craft um, kind of things. Go ahead and invite them. I would love to, to see them in here.